NASA looks at going to the moon one day and to Mars, and to get to Mars, they're going nuclear. In the grand tapestry of human endeavors, the trajectory from telecommunication to interstellar exploration is marked by an unyielding pursuit of progress. A relentless yearning to traverse distances at unimaginable speeds. The inconceivable notion of traveling at the speed of light, once dismissed as a fantastical dream, has now become a beacon of possibility, with scientists purportedly cracking the code to propel spacecraft at velocities ten times the speed of light. This monumental milestone, should it materialize, holds the promise of propelling humanity into uncharted cosmic realms. But the journey from theoretical breakthroughs to tangible spacecraft capable of such extraordinary velocities is riddled with scientific complexities, unknowns, and challenges. The narrative begins its odyssey through the annals of technological advancement. Tracing the evolution from faster computers and swifter internet to the development of supersonic aircraft and space probes hurtling through the cosmos at mind-bending speeds. The Concorde, an aviation marvel, marked a historic milestone by achieving supersonic speed, yet even the fastest fighter jets of today lag behind the velocities required for interstellar exploration. The current pinnacle of human speed in space exploration is represented by spacecraft hurtling through the void at speeds of up to 18,000 miles per hour. These vessels, propelled by a combination of liquid oxygen, liquid hydrogen, and iron thrusters, are engineered to escape Earth's gravitational clutches and venture into the vast expanse of outer space. However, the celestial distances humanity aspires to conquer demand velocities that transcend the capabilities of our current propulsion systems. The text, like a celestial navigator charting a course through the cosmos, steers its course toward the dream of achieving light speed travel. The cosmic scale of interstellar distances, measured in light years, underscores the necessity of breaking free from the shackles of conventional speed limits. Yet, the specter of Einstein's theory of relativity looms large, positing an insurmountable barrier for objects with mass to attain or surpass the speed of light. Amidst the scientific exploration, the narrative takes an unexpected detour into the realm of unidentified flying objects, UFOs. Credible accounts, such as the testimony of retired Navy veteran David Fravor, recount encounters with UFOs executing maneuvers defying the laws of physics. The discussion delves into the controversy surrounding these sightings and contemplates the possibility of extraterrestrial propulsion systems operating at speeds beyond human comprehension. The journey continues with whistleblower David Grouch's revelations, injecting an element of intrigue into the discourse. Claims of non-human remains recovered from UFO crash sites and clandestine efforts to reverse engineer alien technology by government agencies weave a narrative thread that ties together elements of science fiction and purported governmental secrets. The plot thickens as the concept of warp drive emerges, a hypothetical propulsion system reminiscent of science fiction sagas like Star Trek. Theoretical physicist Miguel Alcabier's model proposes manipulating spacetime itself, creating a warp bubble that could propel a spacecraft faster than the speed of light. The allure of such a concept is undeniable, offering a potential solution to the seemingly insurmountable challenge of achieving interstellar travel. The narrative, akin to an intrepid explorer forging through uncharted territories, scrutinizes the scientific basis of the warp drive. Alcabier's model, rooted in the principles of general relativity, envisions a spacecraft enveloped in a bubble of manipulated spacetime, effectively bypassing the limitations imposed by the speed of light. However, the feasibility of such a propulsion system hinges on resolving colossal challenges, the colossal energy requirements and the elusive quest for negative energy, a substance that remains purely theoretical. As the narrative navigates the turbulent waters of scientific speculation and theoretical physics, it contemplates the potential convergence of science and science fiction. The elusive warp drive, if realized, could propel humanity into a new era of cosmic exploration. The narrative paints a vivid picture of the hurdles faced by physicists, theoretical scientists, 
and engineers in their quest to overcome these challenges and transform warp drive from a captivating concept into a tangible reality. The text unfurls like a cosmic tapestry, intertwining threads of theoretical physics, UFO encounters, and the tantalizing prospect of interstellar travel. The exploration of warp drive technology becomes a metaphorical journey through the intricacies of manipulating space-time, a quest to unlock the secrets of the universe. The narrative doesn't shy away from the perplexing questions that warp drive poses. Would such a technological marvel enable humanity to traverse the vast interstellar distances at speeds exceeding the speed of light? Could we truly witness the dawn of an era where starships traverse the cosmic seas at velocities ten times the speed of light? The answers to these questions are elusive, shrouded in the uncertainties that accompany groundbreaking scientific endeavors. The text speculates on the colossal energy demands of propelling a spacecraft beyond light speed. It emphasizes the immense challenge of harnessing energy beyond current technological boundaries. In the vast cosmic ballet of scientific exploration, the text shifts its focus to the potential consequences of unprecedented speeds. It delves into the theoretical realm of negative energy, a mysterious substance that eludes our current understanding. For warp drive to become a reality, scientists must navigate uncharted territories of physics. Unravel the enigma of negative energy, and master its properties to propel interstellar travel into new frontiers. Rushing toward its conclusion, the narrative reflects on the dreams woven into the pursuit of warp drive technology. Scientists, researchers, and dreamers unite in a collective endeavor to redefine the boundaries of what is considered possible. Despite skeptics and challenges along the journey, the prevailing theme is one of human ingenuity, and an unwavering spirit of exploration. The text, like a cosmic scribe, notes the mysteries in the quest for warp drive, posing the question, not if but when will humanity witness its realization. The answer remains concealed in the cosmic dance of scientific discovery, awaiting the convergence of theory and reality. In its twilight, the text speculates on secret government agencies venturing into the cosmic unknown. Alleged encounters with extraterrestrial tech, covert advancements, and the enigmatic intersection of classified projects with otherworldly propulsion systems blur the lines between fact and fiction. The text acknowledges the absence of concrete evidence for current interstellar travel capabilities. Warp drive prospects, though tantalizing, remain in the realm of scientific inquiry and speculation. The narrative's finale leaves us in awe, sparking curiosity about faster-than-light travel, and the cosmic quest to uncover the universe's secrets. It's a symphony of human exploration, inviting readers to gaze at the stars, ponder limitless possibilities, and embark on their intellectual voyage into the cosmic unknown. Thank you for watching another episode of Elysee, while you are still here don't forget to like and subscribe.